All right, guys, I know that some uh, commercial whiskies, for example, are distilled from a wash as low as five or six percent. I know that sounds crazy, but there are some out there and they're delicious. So we know that works at least. I've never distilled that low. And uh, I have a mystery wash in the pot, in the boiler right now, ready to go. And it is only two and a half percent. I've got no idea what's going to happen. I don't know if this is going to work out. Uh, so I thought I'd share it with you guys and we can learn together. <laughs> How's it going chasers? I hope you're having a kick-ass week. I'm Jesse and this is still at the channel all about chasing the craft of home distillation and making it a legitimate hobby. So uh, like I said guys, I've got something in the pot. Uh, I'm not going to tell you what it is because it's a, it's a surprise. It's a, it's, a, it's a video all by itself. But this whole sort of internal debate about whether or not it's going to work at 2.5% doesn't really fit into that video, so I thought I'd make a little video now. It's going to be a while before that video comes out, and uh, you guys can, you know, join along and uh, see what happens. So here's the deal, guys. I've got 14 litres of 2.5% ABV in this pot. But uh, I want to get it to a meaningful ABV, uh, and I want to retain some of the flavour in there. In fact, I, I would love to retain a whole lot of flavour in there. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run this through the plated still and I'm going to use three plates now I I don't know I really don't know what ABV I can meaningfully get here I've just never gone this slow I I haven't had enough experience at data points far enough away from the sort of six to ten percent range to really know if things are going to be linear when we go this far down so what I want you guys to do is hit pause on the video right now don't cheat don't cheat Hit pause in the video, drop a comment in the comment section down below, and tell me what you think the ABV is going to be. Uh, not the first drips, not the last drips obviously, but the blended product. The stuff that tastes good that I can keep, what you think that ABV is going to be. Should we give it a nudge? <laughs> so we've been up to temperature with this 2.5% uh, wash for roughly 15, 20 minutes now. I've just been letting it sort of balance out. Uh, and I do believe we are about ready to start bleeding out uh, some product off the spout. Now I'm gonna make the offtake on this one quite slow, much slower than I normally would with four inch plates, just because of that really low ABV. But uh, you ready guys? Let's see what happens. Alright team, this is what we took off the still. Uh, obviously not a lot of product, but that makes sense, right? It was only 2.5%. So I've decided that uh, these I'm calling heads slash four shots. We're taking those out of the picture. Uh, this I'm calling tails, uh, and there's actually another jar over there that was so nasty I just didn't even bring it over here. I just left it over there. Uh, I'll pop that straight into my faints collection jar. This is what we have left. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. I guess seven jars and probably one, two, maybe I'm guessing it's going to be about 350 mils of spirit all up, 300 mils, something like that. Um, so I guess let's get this all blended together and we can test ABV. <laughs> Eighty six percent, which is pretty freaking crazy when you think about it. So, uh, you know, if you guessed somewhere around there and you weren't cheating in the comments down below, congratulations. Well done. Uh, you get my gratitude and respect. I mean, that's it. You don't you don't get anything else. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I did not think I was going to be hitting eighty six percent. I mean, all up, there was what, like maybe four liters of pure alcohol in that pot, maybe a little more, I guess it, mm, four and a half, something like that. To be able to pull out 300 mils at 86%, starting with two and a half percent with only three plates, uh, that's pretty freaking cool. And I know this probably isn't news to a lot of you guys that use plates a lot, 
Uh, but it is something that I wanted to do to push the boundaries to get a better understanding of how this stuff works and just what the possibilities are, right? Like the reason that I ran this two and a half percent is that I've got a conceptual idea on something that I want to do. And don't worry guys, you guys will see it soon enough, don't worry. But the Patreons and I decided that the conceptual restraints of what we were doing were meant that basically we had to have two and a half percent in the pot. That was just the way it was going to work. So to be able to actually distill that to 86 percent, pretty freaking cool. That's only three plates. Anyway guys, anyway, uh, I know this is a weird, weird video, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway, I really do, and uh, if you do, give me a thumbs up, I would appreciate that very much down below, uh, like, drop a comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll catch you next time guys, keep on chasing the craft, see ya.